just So this is in D.C. Mm-hmm. And so there's a council member. His name is Charles Allen. Doesn't matter. Anyway, his new bill that he wants is to give people the power to ticket illegally park cars with a simple cell phone picture. What's this? Oh, sorry, Randy. Looks like you got a ticket. A ticket? So it would be this app that was developed. You bloop the picture, send it in, and then it goes and gets to the right people. But if you're talking about blocking a bike lane or blocking yeah. the crosswalk or the fire hydrant or all those horrific things we've seen. Is there a reason you're using your husband's placard to park in the handicap spot today? No. Uh, from the 425, oh, there's a car here that parks in the handicap spot all the time. There's another car that absolutely parks in the bus lane. We cannot get around them. Things like that. This would solve the problem, allegedly. Well, it's a smart idea. I mean, honestly, if you want to uh, enforce parking, it's a smart idea. I'm just wondering about the sort of people that would do this, that would sign up to do this. I guess you think you're, uh, you know, like an authority figure. I think people do get unhappy about, I mean, I get it. We have, so in, in, in our neighborhood, there's always been this kind of unwritten rule, apparently, before we got there, <laughs> that you could park in certain places in the alley if mm. you weren't blocking other cars. Yeah. And it worked fine, according to my neighbor who's been in the neighborhood for 40 years. All I can say is, congratulations on not getting caught. Until, like, the townhouses got built and the fancier cars started coming in. And and I got to say, sorry, folks, sorry, listeners, especially if you're sitting in one right now. <laughs> in a fancy car. <laughs> Let me just refer to BMW drivers as a particular subset Uh-oh. of the people who are really the mo- the biggest offenders. This has actually been proven We're by traffic get studies. Texts. And the BMW drivers in particular in the neighborhood would just park anywhere, like blocking the entire yeah. alley because they saw another car in the alley. Like, well, didn't you? I mean, you could extrapolate what was yeah. happening here. Yeah. People were shoving their cars as close to the fences as they could, allowing other cars to get by. So I actually understand why people would sign up for this and would be uh, want to enforce this in their neighborhoods because people can be real jerks. On the other hand, I get it. I don't want to turn the average person into a police force. My dear officer, you could not even give me a parking ticket. And I particularly don't like the development of traffic tickets, or rather parking tickets being a device for revenue generation yes. and not a not a it's always been sort of a quality of life issue or it was for most of its history and then now it's a revenue generation issue it isn't right it isn't fair there was no parking anywhere